this isn't even. Good morning. It's not extremely early, but it's also not late. I had this grand plan of waking up. I don't know why I thought this was a good idea. Waking up at 8 a.m. to do a Peloton class at 8 and then another one at 8.30. Needless to say, that didn't happen. And I wasn't gonna do any kind of crazy, like, cycling class. No. <laughs> My body doesn't function that early in the morning. Mm -mm. But I was gonna do a yoga class, which started at 8.30, and it was only 20 minutes long, so. Oops. But the lovely thing about recorded workout videos is that they're recorded. So I am gonna do one at 9.30, hopefully. Anywho, I thought I'd provide an update on a couple of things. Can you even hear me? You're really far away. You're like my arm's distance away, but I don't want my husband eavesdropping on me. A couple updates. TikTok. I have successfully, well, sort of, not scrolled TikTok for the entire month of January. It was not hard to get. No, it wasn't. I did go on the app a couple of times to look up specific topics, which is interesting because I used to use YouTube for that, but since so many more people are posting on TikTok, I found those topics a lot better but other than that <clears throat> haven't been scrolling don't really miss it am i gonna come back probably is it gonna be worse than what i left probably i do feel less pressure um on on what am i trying to say non-existent Whatever. I, I do feel less of that weird, not real pressure that one feels when they're overwhelmed by the amount of content on the internet. Um, yeah, that's gone. I did make two TikToks actually while I was off TikTok. They were okay. They did okay. It was fun for 20 minutes, but I don't miss it that much. I wouldn't be sad if it disappeared. Basically, my dream in life right now is to become a professional vacationer. I'm not very good at it though, so. I mean, I'm good at doing nothing. No, I'm not even good at that. Wish me luck on that trip. I mean, goal, dream. I'm going to a movie with my husband today that I don't really care about, but I'm going. And also a random basketball game. It's gonna be a busy day. So we're going to the other movie theater. We stopped playing pickleball because it got cold. That movie made me want to be a movie director. You're ignoring me. Yeah. Even though I'm directing my own movie right now. Oh wait, I gotta make sure that the horizon is interesting. The horizon's at the bottom. Okay, that's interesting. And I turned it on already. The horizon's at the bottom.
tart, bubbly, quenchy. Tart, it's bubbly, it's quenchy. probably wouldn't have woken up for if I hadn't woken up first. Happy Monday. I'm playing hooky. Just kidding, I'm not. My boss actually told me I should take a mental health day and this was the last opportunity that I had to do that before getting into something else with work. Yay me. I had all these things that I was going to say planned out in my head and now that I've sat down to talk, I don't remember what they were. So I went back on TikTok this weekend after my month hiatus from the app, which, wow, um, it wasn't that hard to get up. It wasn't hard not to sit and scroll through TikTok, but man, was it easy to get back to. There are a number of things that I learned from opening TikTok yesterday. I learned that a number of uh, normal things that we did when I was in junior high and high school are trendy now. One of which being little pocket digital point and shoot cameras. They're trendy now. Actually, I think they've been trendy for a couple of months, but you know, I live in a bubble and didn't know that until I went on to TikTok yesterday. So naturally, I had these feelings inside that I wanted to be part of the cool group of people slash their probably kids um, jumping on this point and shoot bandwagon. And so I dug through my underwear <laughs> where I keep my point and shoot camera that I haven't used in seven years and tried to plug it in to get it to work. And to my dismay, it did not work. Well, the battery did. It's likely dead. But what really disturbed me was this pull, this pull I felt to make this camera work. When in reality, once I put it in my underwear, it was, I'm never using you again. Actually, funny, funny thing. The digital camera that I had hiding in my underwear, I was using all the way up until 2015 when I bought my Sony A5000 that I have also since stopped using because it is also an old camera, but it's not a cute little point and shoot that takes crappy photos. The funny thing about the point and shoot situation is that they're digital photos. So I think you can manipulate iPhone photos to look like crappy digital camera photos. It is much harder to manipulate iPhone photos, cell phone photos to look like film photos. But that's what was going through my head yesterday. So since I've taken today off, I had this grand plan of going shopping. I am going on a trip to Disney World at the end of February. And I have a couple things that I want to make sure that I have for this trip, but also any future trips that I decide to go on. So I am having a me day, sort of. I'll probably be out for like an hour or two. It's gonna take me longer to get there and back than it will for me to actually be there. But I thought that it would be a nice day to do that because it is a Monday, it's not a holiday, so it shouldn't be busy. I don't wanna sit around my apartment all day because I did that yesterday. We shall see. Thank you. 
That I really just honestly didn't even know. Like, I also think about the math. I can take a video of me throwing. Night night. <laughs> Rest in peace. My Adidas shoes. This hurts. Cheers to a long day of shopping. <laughs>